and we're back with another video for your viewing pleasure. That's Elias with us. We're in the car. He's playing with the gears. You'll see him in a minute. We are excited. I'm starving. I haven't eaten all day. We are at Head and Finn. Do you see them? Mm -hmm. Head and Finn. They are a black-owned, family-owned establishment in Waldorf, Maryland. They're connected to a like um, gas station. We'll talk more about that. <laughs> Let's eat. Um, so they have those platters that come with size and boxes and stuff. So I got us the the head and fin, which is three wings, two pieces of fish, and then I got us the head which is five wings, and then I got us a shrimp box, a small shrimp box with five shrimp and some and some French fries. Um, the sides with our dinners are mac and cheese, potato salad, collard greens, and green beans. And Elias has already started on his side of mac and cheese. Can't really see it. But he's eating a lot of it. And he is talking to today. They did not give us any utensils. So we have to use some utensils I found in the car. Elias' Elias's utensils. Do you have the top for this? Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> so we um we're about to start eating because we are hungry. Mm -hmm. Um so I'm gonna get you can show uh -huh. them. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Why would you do that? You just So <laughs> what would you do that, was the, I believe this is the what was the, the big hen? The the big, the has the chicken in it, the chicken in it. He just dumped it all on his face. I need some napkins. Because he is, he's just, he's rubbing it in his. I know, I know. You don't want it on your face. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. No? Okay, he sees the food. So, pass me. Okay. So, this is the wings. I think this is the shrimp. Yes, the shrimp box. This is the wings. This is the fries. This is the, sh the wings and fish. What I got. Because I like my wings and fish. And I got some shrimp and fries. A little box. Just so we can try the shrimp. Just so we can try the fries. Um, Elias likes fries. Maybe he'll make appearance later. Now they have a seafood sauce, tartar sauce. We bought our, um, we have our sweet baby rays on deck. And making its debut on this channel. Our Old Bay Hi, sauce. I haven't tried it. I haven't tried it. He has, I'm excited. I wanna try it on. A piece of fish. Elias, you cannot hear. Elias is 10 months, y'all. So he's just like grabbing everything type of mood. Yes. Hopefully we can do like a one month video. Come on, here. A one year video? <laughs> well, sir. You said one month. I was like. Sorry. My sugar low. I'm hungry. Okay. You ready? What are you gonna try first? I'm mean, the French fries is good. They'd be off the train if they were like not soggy. But mm -hmm. that's a cute little box. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He's organizing all the sides and I'm here snacking on the fries because I'm hungry. <clears throat> so do you wanna start with? I want to start with, of course, the shrimp. The shrimp. And, yeah, I want to try it in the seafood sauce, too. This is going to be... I'm going to try to make it a long video, but... Who knows? <laughs> okay, seafood sauce. This is some good stuff mm. a plus no, 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 no. 
We're married. You can double up. A plus plus from the seafood sauce. Mm -hmm. This sauce is like, it's sweet. Um, Savory. It's, so, it's just right. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. mm. It's mm. definitely a seafood sauce, though. But I can eat that with crabs. Are like, we have some crabs? Definitely. I don't know why little man was so focused on drinking it. Yeah, we had him thing, and Elias had like lifted and started sucking some out. Mm -hmm. And I was like, really, dude? And he, I know why, it's whoever. Alright, I'm talking fish. Alright, look, we're doing chicken. What fish with this? Do fish nuts. Alright, I'm going to. Try some on my fish. And the fish looks good. They give you two pieces. I got whiting because the latte don't do bones. And they give you bread too. So it's my first time trying the fish. And that's what I'm gonna try the fish first without the hot sauce. Oh. It's all right. Not much seasoning. So we'll just half sauce right now. This is really good. You cannot have none of this hot sauce. You want to try these? Sure. I'm just going to go ahead and put it all over the hot sauce. Go oh, ahead. Oh, this is good. I'm going to try it. This, is, this sauce is good. Seafood sauce is good. A piece of fish. There you go. Here, you want a piece of fish? You can have a piece of fish too, sir. This sauce you just can't have no hot sauce. You're not ready for that yet, sir. Oh. Hmm. oh, yeah, I forgot that tartar sauce. So the tartar sauce is homemade, you can tell. Somebody auntie's back there whipping mayo and all that goodness. Oh, I guess you can see it. It's like beautiful. It's just a be you can't even see it. Oh, oh, they'll be able to. In you know, post production. Oh, they will? Okay. Yeah. In post production. I'm going to try that. Oh, that's all. You know what? This is good. Mm -hmm. okay. The only thing I don't. I'm going to say I'm going to give the fish um, a B. Because it's, it's, it's fresh. Mm -hmm. It's just not seasoned. Mm -hmm. And there's bread under there too. I'm gonna get this. Oh, you put the. They offer mambo sauce, but I didn't take it. Um, we got some right here. Oh, you got mambo? You got the mambo sauce from her? I believe. I believe this is it. Yeah. I don't eat drums. I don't eat flat. So I'm gonna try a flat. In the mambo sauce, if I can get it without it being such a mess. It's cute. Oh, it's cute. It's right. I'm gonna turn it over. You can see it. the mumble sauce dripping. You can't have this. Hmm. Not bad. Here you go, here you go, here you go. Here you go. So he ate a whole thing of, of um, here, Pop. He ate a whole thing of mac and cheese. <laughs> what do you want? He wants that bottle because it's red. Because he didn't want nothing else before. Sorry, son. You can't have it. Now he wants it. <laughs> so we tried the shrimp. We tried the chicken. Food. What are your grades? I don't gave my grades. What are your grades, Tay? The shrimp with the seafood sauce, A+. Plus. Bottom line. The fish, I look like a B-. minus. It could be, it'd be better. It's all right. Chicken, C. Without... 
the chicken by itself, mm -hmm. see, with the with the mumble sauce and hot sauce, bring it up to about a B. Boy, what you doing with your little fingers in my sauce, sir? But the seafood sauce is definitely like the selling point. It's like, you gotta put this on everything from the fries to the chicken to the shrimp to the fish. Hell, maybe even to the bread. Let me try with the fish. I got no, I don't have some with no hot sauce on it. Let me try some seafood sauce. I'll get this thing open. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I want to go again. I'll probably get the 10 piece. We got the five piece shrimp. I'll get the 10 piece shrimp with fries. Mm -hmm. And I'll get probably a piece of fish. Piece of fish. You know, if I'm really hungry. Um. Yeah, I have to agree that the chicken is okay, but the fish is good. So, my overall score. Mmm, this stuff is good. Hey, we haven't even tried our size. I'm about to give a full score and haven't even tried our size yet. Well, let's do a size. Mm -hmm. This is going to be a food all day. It's a lot of food. Mm -hmm. That is... Again, we don't have it so where they didn't give us any. So we are using Elias's. As long as it gets the job done, I'll let you. So this is collard green greens. and kale green. Collard and kale green. Is that the juice? Oh, did you do it? Did you go zoom in? I'm oh. sorry. Let me make that. Mm. And supposedly on the paper it says that they're cooked with um turkey meat. Mm. Taste it. Why am I only one eating the size? Get your greens in, sir. Hmm. It's past your nap time. Is that what it is? It's good. You like it? I like it. I don't. Mm, I don't. I wouldn't order it again. Well, next thing to judge is the tater salad. Tater salad. Not made by Karen. Thank you, Lord. Mm, that's a little chunk in there. Mm, sorry. Taste it. We're supposed to be eating it together. I've tasted better. It's a little watery. Mm -hmm. Um, it's not bad though. Like I feel like if I eat that tomorrow, it might be slamming. Yeah. They might have made it today. It might be like fresh today, and so um, mm -hmm. that's probably why. Let's go to the string beans. Oh, I saw somebody get cabbage. The cabbage looks so good in seasons. I have, I'll next time I go, I'll try the, the cabbage. String beans, string beans. It's, oh, it's definitely got meat in it. Hmm, let me try some. Not bad, but. It's what I would expect of, of, a typ of typical string beans. They're not bad. All you need is some black pepper. Mm-hmm. A little bit of salt. Them niggas is jumping. The whatever liquid they use from the string beans, they need to use on them collard greens. Yeah. We got different taste buds. <laughs> it tells. Because I can eat those string beans. If you want to trade the collard greens... Since I like the collard greens, since I like the string beans, you like collard greens, you want to trade? Because I ordered mac and cheese and collard greens. And he ordered potato salad and string beans. So. Oh, shoot, I lost my. Oh, the and light. the creme de la creme. It's too bright outside. The sun just. You know, you got to get this shot. This is a. Oh, my. You see this here? Tell you got to make sure they get this. Oh, it's dripping with the butter and the. 
Oh, this looks so good. And they got a little dark beans. Oh, they. Mm. Mm. That's good. You hear that? That's the sound of love, baby. Let me tell you something. Mmm. 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 So my auntie mm. is making that mac and cheese. And they're mm -hmm. doing a damn thing. I could go there. If I go there and get a meal, I will get whatever meal. But, and then have it with the collard greens. No, I keep saying collard But the string beans and macaroni and cheese is good. Yeah, that potato salad. It's probably good tomorrow because it's so fresh. Mm -hmm. And if you a potato salad connoisseur, ooh, excuse me. If you're a potato salad connoisseur, then you understand where we're com where I'm coming from when I say it's so fresh. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. this thing is good. This is I can get a large one and be good. What about my meal? So we have we tasted everything. Have we? I believe so. We got we, we tasted the potato salad, collard greens. The main boxes, the uh, string okay. beans, and the mac and cheese. So, what would you say, like, if you had to go back and get an order, so what would you get? I would definitely get the shrimp with the seafood sauce. I'd probably get like five cups of seafood sauce and just pour it on everything. I definitely get the mac and cheese, everything that's in the box. Oh. I definitely get the mac and cheese. That'd probably be my definite go to's because the fish and the chicken. Sir, no. The fish and the chicken are okay. We got all this food in here, and you finna eat a penny? Are you crazy? That's our boy. As I definitely I'm sorry. do. sorry. <laughs> That's why I definitely do. That's be my go-to. What would yours be? The shrimp, the fish, the chicken wings, and um, definitely the mac. Please, whoever is doing the mac and cheese out there, do not fire them. Love on them, heaven shine upon them. Oh my god. I ain't feeling plastic straws. Hey. God, leave, man. We have our own cup. How you see me drink out one cup and you put your straw in and start drinking? Oh, Five second one. Are they the paper straws? Yeah, paper straws. You said no ice, right? Mm hmm. They put no ice in both of them. <laughs> you want Yes, yes. Uh, little man is uh is hankering for something. He wants to nurse. I was just nursing before. So, with all that said, here's my grade of the place. Overall, with experience. Overall, with the experience, I'd give it. I give it a B plus. It's mine. Why not an A? Why not A? Because. Some of my expectations with at least the chicken wings and the fish, I expected them to be as as soon as I tasted the shrimp without the seafood sauce and then with it, I kind of expected it to be just as good by itself with no sauce. But that wasn't the case with the chicken and with the chicken and fish. You know, they just tasted like they, they just had no seasoning in the batter or anything. So that's why. Um, the potato salad, I was like I said, I was looking forward to that being flavorful. Um, but considering it probably it's fresh, it wasn't as good as I thought it'd be. I'll probably change that'll probably change in 24 hours. Or we probably put this Let thing me in, taste it again. I'm sorry. In the in the refrigerator. I'm gonna do it. Looks like you can keep going. I just Yeah. Like, imagine if you just made it before you wrap it up, put it in the refrigerator, and, and what, then... You know what? She has a whole bunch of vinegar. Who I made? She or he. Sorry. Probably a whole lot of vinegar. What would you be your um your score or? So, I would definitely return to this place. Oh, yeah. Yeah, seafood's on point. Customer service is good. Um, we had a little hiccup where they 
we got somebody else's food and we went back. It was just a little mess, but mm. they were covered well. Great customer service. Um, the food is good. You know, everything is fresh. Um, like, I would get the greens again. They were bland. The potato salad. If they don't put vinegar, it's something too much or something. It's just super watery. Like I said, tomorrow when everything kind of congeals mm -hmm. and soaks in, it'll be bomb. Um, the bag and cheese is heavenly. Oh my God, it's heavenly. The shrimp is good. The seafood sauce is amazing. I would give this my rate. I'm mm -hmm. going to be a little more lenient and say I would give them an A, not an A+. Plus. Um, just because everything that was good outweighed the bad. The chicken is bad. Um, that's really it. The, the collard greens. But mm -hmm. um, unless you came in the air and ordered the chicken wings and collard greens, then you'd be really disappointed. Oops. <laughs> Support. But um and it's black owned and it's a family owned restaurant and they even have a drive through that we saw. Yeah. So that was exciting. I might try that out next time I'm just me and the baby. Um but I would definitely say if you're you are in the Waldorf area, um the address is one oh one nine five Barry Road. Um that's two two eight for my locals. It is literally in, inside of the uh, Shell yes, Mart of Gas Cell Gas Station. Oh, here's the thing. It's coming soon. They're going to have a new location on Georgia Ave. So, Those uh, of you in D.C.? That's going to be fun. Elias, do you want to say anything as we wrap up? Because we're going to wrap up. Do you want to say anything, sir? Here. Elias, say hi. Say hi, Dean. Hey, hi, man. Hey, hi. He like, who y'all saying hello to? Wow, he must be telling a story. I think he's giving he subtitles. He's giving a review. He's giving a review. Well, with that being said, this ends another edition of Let's Eat. And we'll see you all next Friday. Yes. These cow these are good. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got a piece of meat up in here. Oh, this is a turkey. Mm, turkey meat. Mm. Mm hmm.